panic. It generally feels we reached a point where people are racist against white people. That fellow, instead of moving past uh, di- divis- di- divisiveness, we just changed who we are racist against. Yeah, yeah. It's crazy. It's crazy. Like, for example, all these politicians that come out, like, well, I forget who said it. It was a panic. You said it. That come out and say, oh, our cabinet is is diverse and we represent the population you know we have uh we got gay we got lesbian we got trans we got white we got black we got women we got asian we got this 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 this. well i'm sorry that's not democracy that that's not representing the population right if you're going to represent the population then you should do appoint people in your government or government positions should be held by the percentage of the type of people that are living in your society right so for example one example i have right take take the we'll use elder god you hear elder god my uncle elder god is here i see elder god's comment uh okay gang i'm going all the way down to the bottom of twitch chats i apologize if i'm not reading the twitch chat gang uh, I didn't read it. If there's anything directed towards me, please repost it. Because I'm going to try to make a point here. And I hope it gets across well enough. Right? And Elder God might be able to tell us this. Elder God, in the UK, um, what do you call it? UK football team. Right? National football team. How many whites, how many blacks, and how many other nationalities? Because when I was watching the games, it looked like, probably 50% of the population 50% of the players at least 50% of the players on the UK national team as well as the French national team were black okay that, that's my guess I didn't bother counting because I don't give a rat's ass right for me race doesn't matter right that's why I don't believe that someone should be hired for a position based on them being this 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 show me what you've done more for right that's what matters to me not if your skin tone is darker than mine or lighter than mine or if you got two balls between your legs or you don't have two balls between your legs right so based on uk national football team and french national football team if i was an alien coming to earth i would assume if this was supposed to be a direct democracy a democracy of this of this population that goes by DEI and stuff like this that 50% of the population of the UK is black and 50% of the population of France is black that's what I would assume right a lot more uh, than that national percentage a lot more that than uh, national percentage yeah yeah it was a way more percentage so I don't see white people saying hey you're not representing a true demographic of what the UK government, uh, um, the population of the UK is, right? Because it shouldn't matter, right? It's your merit, it's what you can do that should matter. And then take the Canadian team. I mean, I watched the Canadian in Copa, Copa America. I didn't do the count, I don't know. But it wasn't 50% of the players were black, but there were a few black people there, right? And I live in Canada, and I can tell you, even though I've had black friends, right? There aren't that many blacks in Canada, right? I made it a point when I traveled to the east coast of Canada to go to Halifax and go to the neighborhood where blacks, um, what was it called? Um, midnight, uh, where black slaves were escaping from the United States to come to Canada. There's a sort of there's a word for it let's find out my note but someone that knows history there's a word for it. it's like a midnight not midnight dream something like this right that they all went to that neighborhood a lot of the black slaves with that i made it a point to go there the hostel i was staying at was in that area and there's a lot of blacks there it was super cool to see that was in the late 1980s i did this right early 1990s late 1980s i did this especially going to a black area the blackest area in canada which was there where the slaves were going in that's where i got the hostel just to get a feel for it right but there aren't that many blacks in canada to have that many blacks if you're doing direct representation in the canadian football team or canadian soccer team right we live in a cl- 
clown world right now run by clowns that are uh, their allegiances are to institutions that are not uh, they don't have the best interests of our nations of us in mind we have to deal with that underground railroad thank you very much plutonic floors the underground railroad right 